Great white sharks are known as fearsome predators, of course, but in the Monterey Bay, there's more fascination than fear over what may be a great white shark baby boom. KPI X5's Len Ramirez reports from Moss Landing. Well, shark sightings have been definitely on the increase in Monterey Bay, but what's unusual this year is the high number of juvenile or young sharks that people are seeing, leading to some speculation that the Monterey Bay may not only just be a breeding ground for sharks, but also some sort of a shark nursery. You're unlikely to see them from the shoreline, but from this perspective, a thousand feet up in a helicopter, it's easy to see what some are calling a population explosion of great white sharks. Recently, we've been seeing really big sharks and then a little baby. Helicopter pilot Chris Goulart has been flying sightseeing trips over Monterey Bay for decades, but in recent weeks, he and others have been seeing up to 60 sharks on a single flight. And what we've been seeing has been developing into what really looks like the, the great white sharks are having their babies in the Monterey Bay, which is super, super cool. Little is known about how and where great white sharks give birth, but if true, this would be the farthest north a great white shark nesting area has been discovered. Goulart says the sharks seem unusually docile around humans out in the water, and he hopes state and federal scientists begin tagging and tracking the great whites in the area so everyone can learn more. It's up to 60 great white sharks mixing with surfers and kayakers and all this stuff, and it's all on the shoreline here. And you see the little babies, you see the big ones, and they're not, nobody's getting attacked in that zone. Nobody's getting, getting a shark bite. And so, why? Shark watchers say that right now we are at the peak of the observation season and that the number of sightings will probably start decreasing at the end of November. In Moss Landing, Len Ramirez, KPIX 5.